guys, it's Sudi here and welcome back to another video. Today is the day. It's finally time for Cornflake to meet my female mice. So my male mouse Cornflake got neutered a while ago. I have a video up that you can watch all about it and his care afterwards and stuff like that. So now it's been two and a half weeks since he got neutered. Now, I found it really hard to actually find out when was the best time to introduce them. Pretty much nothing comes up when you try to search it for mice, so I had to kind of go off what people do with rats. Some people say two weeks, some people say three weeks, some people say just one week or four weeks, and I don't know, but the one I've heard the most is two weeks, so we're going with two and a half. Basically, uh, you do have to wait a little bit until you can introduce your neutered male with your females, because they can potentially still carry some swimmers you know but uh yeah we're gonna do this slowly we're just gonna start with putting them on my desk a neutral area for them where it's all clean doesn't smell like any of the mice so it's a new place for everyone and here is cornflake uh he is recovering very well from his neuter everything is uh very good he had his last checkup a few days ago where they just check over everything to make sure it's healing well and everything looks fine this is the first time ever meeting these girls, I'm a bit nervous, but but I feel really bad for him because I feel like he's been really bored lately. Um, and I just feel really bad that he's been alone for so long. So here we go. You guys realize there's another mouse there, right? Oh. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, that was so cute. Girls really don't give a shit. <laughs> They're just like, oh yeah, he's always been here. Oh, why you smell so bad? So cute. Oh my god, this is going really well. I'm so happy. I was so scared that they were gonna be just like really bitchy and like fight him or something. Oh my god, it's so cute. Oh my god. No, are you really trying to get in there? What the heck? What the? Oh my gosh, you guys. They really don't get. You can't fit in there. You're too fat. Oh my god, she's stuck. No. Oh my god. Oh my god, she got in. Missy. You can't be in there. Oh my god. She's st- Oh my god, she's stepping on him. Wow! Oh, okay, okay. You guys are so naughty. Oh my god. 
Are you kidding me? Get off that! That's dangerous! Jesus. Okay, don't you start too. Guys, you have a new brother! Seriously? <laughs> oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Why are you guys like this? Alright, next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put them all in this, which is what I use as a, hey, what I use as a carrier. Um, it's all been cleaned out since the last time I used it. Just gonna put some paper towels down. And I'm gonna put them all in there. Now you guys don't have anything to try and climb on in here. And I'm going to clean out the girls' cage. Going to change their bedding and stuff like that. Um, and I'm gonna let them chill in here while I do that. Just so I can keep an eye on them and they can have a sniff for each other. I'm gonna put some food in here too, actually. little man. So they've been in here for about an hour, maybe longer, just while I was cleaning out the cage, changing all the bedding, cleaning all the toys and everything like that. I have this uh, toy I want to put in there too, this new toy. I got it from AliExpress. It's like a little house thingy. Looks pretty cute. I was actually saving it because I ordered a bunch of stuff from AliExpress for them. I was going to do a video on that. But I thought I'd just open this one now. Um, I probably will still make that video, but I just want to open this one now just so there's like a new thing in there for them. Hopefully this will actually be big enough for them. It's all made up. It's actually really good quality and it's really cute. They can go through all different ways to get inside and stuff, so I think they'll like this. All right, here's the cage, all clean. It has changed a bit since the last time I uh, showed you guys, let's say. I got some more stuff. Got a new hammock and added some different stuff here. Also got a bit of lid that my dad helped me make, so that's cool. So yeah, gonna put them all in here and see how they go. I'm sure Complex is gonna be so happy because he's been in his bin cage for so long, he's probably really bored of it, so I think he's gonna like this. <laughs> I do apologize about the bad lighting. I am filming this at night, so it's not exactly the best, but uh, where did Complex go? I actually don't know where he went. <laughs> But the girls are running around doing this thing. Oh, he's behind the wheel. Do you like it, buddy? What do you think, buddy? Aw, he's so cute. I love seeing them run around like this. It's so cute. <laughs> what are you doing up there? Obviously I'm gonna keep an eye on them, make sure no one's bullying anyone, but they seem to be doing really well at the moment. The girls aren't being territorial over anything, so that's really good and I'm just really happy that it's going well. So I'll update you guys in a few days, let you know how they're doing. Hey guys, 
I'm here in voiceover form. I'm recording this audio the day the video goes up. So it's been like one or two weeks since I first started this video. Basically I just filmed a bunch of different bits and pieces of them throughout the couple of weeks that it's been. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys like this little montage of different cute videos of mice. You can never get enough mice. So yeah, basically everything's gone super good. Um, they're all doing fine. No fights or anything like that. They've been super good and I'm so happy about that. There can be like occasions where it doesn't go well, but usually it does go pretty well. And I'm so glad I decided to new to the cornflake because I think I would've just felt pretty horrible if I kept him alone his entire life. And he's definitely super happy and I'm just really happy that I did this because it's so rewarding. I may have spent altogether over $200 on this mouse for everything, for surgery and checkups and everything else, but it was definitely worth it and um, I definitely recommend you get a male mouse neutered so they can be with females. Um, it's definitely really rewarding. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope it could be helpful for you guys and I'll see you guys in the next one. Just enjoy the rest of the video. Bye! He's just confused. He's just like, what the hell is that thing? Fuck that thing. Fuck, disgusting.